Unless I get a different fucking guest, I'm not doing this again. Calpy Ferris is still with us. I, he hasn't gone into a diabetic coma yet. Oh, I like you. I like your robe. That's Thank pretty you. cool. It's pretty nice. Yeah, it's new. It's uh, hiding a lot. Yeah. Well, it's doing its job. I didn't want to really say anything, but I watched the last episode, and I have to say you have uh, you have really let yourself go. Well, that hurts a little bit, but <laughs> like I know they say that the camera adds ten pounds, but you've eaten like twelve cameras. <laughs> An expensive eating habit. It's... This is a mean fucking <laughs> show. You have gotten <laughs> fucking fat. I have some monologue jokes. You want to hear a monologue joke? Yeah, yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah. I got another one for you. Uh, UK's Prince Charles has uh, recovered from COVID-19 and is uh, in good health. Unfortunately, his brother Prince Andrew is still a pedophile and a rapist. So, mm. yeah, it turns out you need more than a 14-day quarantine to get over that one. <laughs> so, uh... Did you hear about the uh, Indian bakery? I don't know if I do want to. Or they had to lay off all the non essential staff. <laughs> <laughs> like the bread that they make. Yeah, I think I got it. Anyways, we have a guest on the show tonight. Uh, yeah, we've got a guest uh, coming all the way from his bedroom. Please uh, join us in welcoming uh, Jordan Von Strauss, everybody. Oh, Jordan Von Strauss. <laughs> Oh, I thought you're. Oh no, I thought you guys were standing up to like clap me in or whatever. But it definitely saved you ah. first. I'm really sorry about this offensive thing that should not have been left there. I can't believe. Holy fuck, Jordan! Yeah, thanks for being on the show. It's great to see you here. Six um, feet distance. Six feet distance. Back up. Six feet. Hold the trigger. <laughs> I got no trigger discipline. Just, I got none. Uh, if this was real, <laughs> I would have killed. I would have been just like the scene in Pulp Fiction. Marvin, uh, boom! I just blew Marvin's fucking face off. Jordan, what's the first thing you're going to do after the quarantine is lifted and we can all do stuff once again? Probably just pick up right where I left off on my murder spree. So it's uh, it was kind of a bad timing thing for me. Hey, Jordan says here, you look like an ostrich, but I hear you like a cock or two. It's a bird joke. Oh. Is that like a cockatoo? Cock or two. It's like a play on words thing he did. It's more like a pun. Yeah, he has a great a crow job. Crow job. What do you, do you have that written down too? Crow job? Crow job. No, that's good though. I'm going to write that down. <laughs> oh, Jordan, did you hear about the uh, Indian bakery? No. Yeah, I was target of a hate crime. It was real sad stuff. Tell her about it. That was pretty much it. What? Sounds like I could use a crow job. <laughs> <laughs> we have another guest on the show. It's, uh, uh, please welcome Jordan Strauss again, everybody. Jordan fucking Strauss again. It's him. Welcome back. I'm so excited to be here again. Never be, you know, you can never be too careful. Gotcha. I just, you guys have got me nervous. Mm. Probably better when it was hot. Yeah, all right. All right, I feel a lot safer now. Um, I feel like I can continue. <laughs> My pubes were melted off at birth. So, Jordan, uh, I hear you do a, uh, I hear you do a fantastic impression of Helen Hunt. Think we could see that? <laughs> <laughs> I would love to Who see the that. fuck is that? Helen Hunt? Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah. They're like from uh, Twister, paid forward. I have a really bad problem. I gotta stop. Boy, we gotta get these Twisters under control. Is that her? Oh, God. Pretty good. Hey, if you can be with me on this, if you can think it's possible that I can do it, then I think maybe I can. Oh, oh dear, look at that wind. It's going curly on us. Jordan, it's great to have you on the show. Thank you. I'm uh, so happy to be here. It's a great hat. I like that hat. Yeah, I know. I've been a horny boy or something. <laughs> it's kind of like, oh, look, blue little. Oh, I'm a horny boy. Actually, I've been playing. Uh, I've been playing a lot of Doom, so like, I pretend to be a demon and shit. No, no okay. like, it's not actually a hat. It's more like, ah. <laughs> we have one more guest on the program for you tonight. Please welcome one more time, Jordan Strauss, everybody. Yeah. One of us should do us all a favor and go out and get it. That's a good idea. All favor in the Nazi bird, going out and getting it. Uh, can you guys to tell I'm wearing my Corona-proof garbage bag? More of a loud look than anything else. I actually saying. think it looks pretty good if you could just do something about this part. The face, maybe it's like that hat and like when it comes to it's yeah. just like yeah. really yeah. ugly kind of. Yeah, but the rest is like, great. It's like, a, it's like a growth, but it's really draws your eye to it. It's not like, I don't know. It's no, it's, it's, but from like the hat and then like a gap that sucks, and then like from the coat down, and then in the middle between the hat and the jacket, there's this really gross thing. I don't know like what it is. A, it's like a growth or like a. Uh, Almost like an aberration. Hey, can you remove that uh, somehow? I don't know if doctors have really encountered something like this. You know what we know about this? I mean, Neil deGrasse Tyson. You can explain what the fuck happened. Sounds like I could use a crow job. <laughs>